Here in Fort Wayne now, a funeral held today for the 17-month-old boy. Police say was beaten to death last week by his mother's boyfriend. The little boy's family invited our Corinne Rose to be at the funeral home today. Aiden Clark's short life was marked by a horrific end. Family and friends streamed into a funeral home Wednesday to honor the toddler who died last week after being beaten. The toddler touched a lot of lives during his time on earth and people at his viewing and funeral were still trying to process why they were there in the first place. I'm like numb, it hurts. He was only one years old, you know what I mean? I have a son. I couldn't think, I couldn't even imagine losing my son and then how the way it just hurts. Fort Wayne police went to the 2700 block of Millbrook Drive at the Brook Mill apartment complex at lunchtime on May 17th. Court documents say little Aiden's mother left him and his twin sister in the care of her boyfriend while she ran an errand. Neighbors told us within 45 minutes of her leaving, paramedics were on scene trying to revive little Aiden. Court papers say the boyfriend, 27-year-old Shaquille Rowe, told detectives he found the boy on the floor when he got out of the shower. Police say because he was the only one there at the time capable of inflicting the fatal injuries, they arrested Rowe for the boy's death. I told myself I was done going to funerals, but I had to be here to support my cousin and the family. Shaquille Rowe is charged with murder and two level one felonies, aggravated battery and neglect of a dependent resulting in death. His next court date is scheduled for June 9th. If convicted on all counts, he faces decades in prison. Little Aiden was 17 months old when he died. Corinne Rose, ABC 21.